Hey there, everybody. It's Indie Gamer News. It's time to play some more Isaac, and this will be a run right after the last run. Uh, I am using a controller. I'm sorry to all of you who hate that, but that's the way it is. And we unlocked Azazel. Unlocked by making three deals with the devil in one game. No, it wasn't Azazel. Lazarus. And I don't know what's special about him. But in the Bible, Lazarus was a guy that was resurrected from the dead, I think, by Jesus. You ever hear of him? He's a very famous cartoon character. Let's get going. Uh, X1. And he's got a pill. So it looks like he does have one extra life. I'm just gonna take this pill. You know what? I'll wait until there's enemies in a room, and then I'll take the pill. Oh, just health up. That's a pretty great start. So it's just a random bonus. Or I wonder if it's always a positive pill. I guess it could... It could randomly not be a bonus, right? It could just be awful right at the start. I love this as a twin... I mean, it's always been a twin-stick shooter, but actually using twin sticks feels real nice. That's Tiny Planet. Yup. Orbiting tears and range up. Oh, my God. Oh, yes. I've wanted to try this for so long. It was one of... I feel like the first items they announced. And come on, look how cool this is. <laughs> Are they spectral? And they're spectral. Which means that they go through solid objects. They're not piercing, though. If they hit an enemy, they will, um... They will break. Hold on, actually, I'm gonna turn down the, uh... Contrast on this a little bit. Did that work? Yeah, I think that'll look better. Yeah, alright. Um, I can't get any of this stuff. It's so sad. It's a lot of good-looking stuff. I mean, this is a hard way to play. I mean, look it. I'm having some trouble just killing this poop here. Ah, come on. You couldn't have been a bomb or a key or a key or a bomb. So I guess most of the time it looks like you just want to be trying to dodge as much as possible while uh, using Tiny Planet. I don't know how I feel about this thing. I mean, look at it. I'm having a lot of trouble just killing this fly. A lot of health laying around on this stage. Doesn't really help me at the moment. Uh, if a bomb could just... Oh, you see, that's that's tough. It's tough luck there. I guess I really have to be paying attention to my actual tears. Where they're at, you know? Come on! Take out this goddamn leaper. It's like the perfect distance away where it's not helping me out. Oh, there's a tinted rock there, too. Ugh, I hope the boss, if I live through it, gives me a bomb. I wonder if there's still such a thing as, like, the special item... Special pool? There was... In the original uh, Binding of Isaac, there was a, a pool of special items. That Most of them were pretty good. And the more special items you had decreased the chance of more special items showing up. I wonder, I wonder if, like, this is a special item. Even though, to tell you the truth, I wouldn't say it's that good. It's just a huge... It's a big change in the way that you play. If I could increase the amount of tears, like, you know, if I got some tears up pills, uh, this thing would be uh, very nice, I think. I guess, does it matter what direction I'm shooting in? It really doesn't, right? Oh, that was a bummer. Come on. There you go. Maybe Tiny Planet is something that you want a little later in the game when you get, like, some real good tier stuff going on. Or maybe I just stink. I could just stink. Which, um, I haven't showered in three days, so... I mean, I haven't gone... I, w I want, you know... What, what am I going to say? We had a party on Saturday, on Sunday, I didn't have to do anything. On Monday, I worked from home, and I took today off so that I could play Binding of Isaac. So, who's going to shower then? Alright, what do you got for me? Some kind of key. Latch key. Luck up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I have three cents, though. Does this help me in any way? Or do I just save these? I only get three cents. I got no bombs. There's no way that there's going to be, like, a three-cent bomb in there. 
I mean, there might be. And then if I got that, then I could get more stuff. Ugh. I think that I could get lucky. Nope. Three cent heart. You know, I'll keep doing this, though. I bet you one more cent we get something, something else unlocked. There's some interesting items there I hadn't seen before. Or at least one. Well, I guess that was a waste of a key, but what are you gonna do? Onwards. Me and my parted creepy hair. Ah, uh, Basement 2. So, pff, I was about to say, I, I guess I'm just focusing on dodging, you know? Like, trying to stay away from these jerks as much as possible. Uh, with the last game, Black Flies actually wouldn't do you any damage. Did I just walk into him and auto-kill him, or did I... Eh, probably not. Alright, that was cool. I got two bombs. That could be useful. Oh, fatties. I'm pretty sure they are called fatties, and I'm not just being a jerk. Um, because... I remember seeing a boss version of him was called, like, Mega Fatty. So, I'm guessing these are regular fatties. That is a boss trap room, which I need to be down to one heart to enter there. So I wonder if my key key luck goes up from having that latch key. Or if I did just really just get two keys from that and that's it. It would be nice to think that I'm getting uh, something else. No item drops there. Oh, Bob, Bob's Rod and Head? Is that what that is? Bob's Rotten Head, reusable ranged bomb. Well, um, I don't hate it. I'm not saying I love it. Come on. But it could be useful. I need to get away from these guys. The orbit's so far out. There we go. <clears throat> Um, well, I guess I have a guess where the secret room might be. I guess I have a guess. Uh, uh. Oh, it stinks not having, like, real good aim. Or controllable aim. I don't know what you want to call it. Right. You go down. There's a key. Uh, I'm going to use a regular bomb here. I think it might be here. It's not there. Uh, boss fight? Yeah, I still get half a spirit heart, so... Larry Jr. Maybe I can cheese him with the... Oh, whoa! I did not expect that to happen. Okay, Bob's Rotten Head, uh... Bounced around my body. Uh, it, it orbited. So that's, that's kind of terrifying. I don't know if I want Bob's Rotten Head anymore. It's not how I expected things to go. Like, at all. Oh no. I also didn't expect to take damage against Larry Jr. Then again, this is a very different way of playing that I am not used to. At all. Oh, those orbits were good. Orbit him to death. Super bandage? No, old bandage. HP up. So it gave me health with no health. Okay. Just didn't fill the health container for me. Now how do you get in there? You gotta you gotta have flying to get in there? Because I'm pretty sure bombs will not blow that up. Well, whatever. I don't want that anyway. It's doctor's remote, I think. Or maybe it's the other one. Teleport. Are there any tinted rocks in here? There's so many rocks in here, you would think that one would be. Doesn't look like it. Ugh. They're real subtle in this game. To the tinted rocks. Come on. And now for this champion. Pills, huh? What you got? Oh, no. No, I guess it doesn't matter. I know what this one does. It puts, like the eyes on the sides of your head so you shoot weird. None of these are tinted, right? No. 
No, I can't see anything. I see no tint. Uh, no real reason to go in there because I got no money. Mm -hmm. oh, someone is texting me. Alright, I'm going to try this stupidly. Ah, okay. Three cents. Well, I could go donate. I think I might. I guess I should really care about, like, winning the run, but... I could also donate. There you go. Store upgrade level one. That's worth it to me. Surprised this is, isn't breaking. Because I know that's what happens. It's like money gets jammed up in it. Did I leave any hearts around? No, let's get out of here. Oh, I would say this is a not-so-great run so far. I will check out the curse room. Black hearts. We know what black hearts do, right? I think I had them on the last run. And they do count as uh, soul hearts, basically. Meaning, you know, you don't take red heart damage when you take black heart damage. So that's nice. They're soul hearts, but better. Basically. I wonder if they... Ah, oh, damn it. I wonder if they up your, um... Oh, what is that? It's like a steel poop. Petrified poop. It feels lucky. Uh, I was saying, I wonder if the uh, black hearts increase your devil room chance because they're so damn evil. There we go. It's not worth the bomb there. I guess I, oh, I can't really use Bob's rotten head effectively. I'm afraid I'm going to hit myself with it. Alright, well that was good positioning to kill them. Yeah, I want to ditch Bob's Rotten Head. Uh, normally I think it's pretty good. Here, I'm going to use it again and see if I was right about that. Yeah, look at it. Yeah, that's, that's, that's tough luck. Ah, oh, this sucks. I want to waste my my bomb to kill this guy. At least the spiders are way less annoying now. They don't have that crazy slide that they used to have. I mean, they're still pretty quick. I need to kill this nest. All right. Those spiders are still no joke. The bloody quad eye spiders or tri triple eye spiders, mutant spiders. A lot of spiders down here. Oh no. I wonder what this petrified poop is doing for me. <gasps> Polyphemus! Ah, oh, it might have been a bad idea. But that's a serious increase in damage. Can I actually get... No. It, it kind of looked like you could get over it that way. I guess not. Now I've definitely taken some red heart damage. But I have Polyphemus. It's gonna be hard to hit things with these tears, but anything I hit should get hurt real bad. All right, nothing here. I'm gonna turn off the light in here. There we go. That's nice and creepier. Uh, I guess I'll take this battery. It doesn't matter. Now I just gotta hope that these things hit, right? Nice thing about Polyphemus is that if it overkills, it does shoot off another tear still. Which can continue on. My heart will continue on and kill. Um. Alright. But what do you say, right here? Maybe? Yup. Huh. I can blow you guys up, can't I? Will, like a bomb place here get all of you or none of you? One of you. Man, that did me no good. Maybe something like this. And there's some money. Maybe I can get an arcade on the next stage if I just hold on to this cash. The way it used to be in Isaac is, uh, hold on, I want to take a look at my colors over here again. 
Sorry about this. This guy got my viewport really small. I mean, it looks okay. It could use a little bit of a, a brightness increase, I think. This, this game's a little, a little tough with the brightness. Let's bring it up to seven. What do you say now? Oh. That's right. Yeah, it looks pretty okay. Yeah, I'll take it. Let me see. Oh, I don't know, man. It's still dark. I'm sorry about this. It's, uh... This is a work in progress, making this look okay. Look, 12? No, that's too much. Let's take that to... Put that at 4. How about that? Oh yeah, there we go. That'll do. Okay. That battery has no use to me. You know, maybe I can get lucky and Bob's rotten head will like hit one of those rocks in just the right way. Or I could do nothing at all. I could totally screw it up. Oh chub. You're gonna friggin' kill me, I already know it. Because I need to be able to shoot you. Well, I do have Polyphemus, so. so I just have to dance. Just have to dance as much as possible. Ugh. And not walk into those? Oh, I made him eat a bomb. That helps. Now I really wish I had saved those bombs. Hit him harder. Oh yeah, I'm a Zazel. I do have that one extra life. I wonder if it's full health from when I started, or if it's the health I have now, or if it's less. I can't imagine it's much. I can't imagine it's as much health as I have now. It's either going to be less, or it's going to be the same as when I started, which I think was three hearts. Oh my god, come on. Really? A big polyphemus shot? Uh, is that speedball? Speedball. Speed and speed shot up. That actually might help me. Having these things fly around a little quicker. Yeah, I think I think that could help. <laughs> oh, the womb is in this now, isn't it? Shit, I forgot about that. There's that arcade I uh, ordered. What am I doing? Who cares about the flies? You need to get rid of these guys. Or else you're just gonna have infinite flies to deal with. Alright. Yeah, okay, that was lucky enough. Is this a penny? Yeah, it's the same as the way it used to be. Uh, I'll take some money, if you got some. Uh, I'll go down to two. Yeah, let's see if we can find some more hearts. Oh man, how am I going to deal with these guys? So I heard supposedly that shot speed up doesn't affect um, that thing you do. Uh, <laughs> it doesn't affect the lump of coal anymore. So hopefully that is the case. Oh, that was so close. There we go. And I'll, I'll spend this. Eleven, I mean twelve cents. Okay. So the upgrade on the shop. I wonder if that takes. Oh Jesus, this is bad. I wonder. If, good thing I got that speed up. I wonder if that takes place right now, or if I have to wait for the, the run to be over. How am I supposed to deal with you? So I got to keep you on the other side of the rocks. Yeah, that that works. I guess kind of. I guess it's luck. I guess luck is how I deal with you. Okay, I think I've already had this pill, right? No? Explosive diarrhea. Holy God! Uh... Alright, that happened. That could actually, I guess, kind of be useful if you knew it was coming. At least I know what it is now. Kind of getting used to this, uh... 
tiny planet situation. Kind of. Oh my god. Another pill. Puberty. That doesn't actually affect me negatively, though, right? It's just puberty. In the last game, it was just, you know, hair that grew out of your head. As you can see right there. Which doesn't do anything, it's just, uh... These guys also have tiny planet shots. It's just aesthetic. Just a dumb little aesthetic. The best one is, I found pills and ate them, which uh, makes you mentally retarded. That's not me making fun of mentally retarded people, it's just what it does. The game definitely does make fun of them, though, because when you take the pill, it goes, Duh! Makes me think of that Rick and Morty episode. This is a microscope that if I used it would have made me retarded. Oh, oh Rick, I, I, I don't know if you're supposed to say retarded anymore. I think that's like a slur. I'm not making fun of retarded people, Morty. I'm just stating a fact. Uh, can't do anything. Oh, no. This room starts off with burning leapers. Oh, they're just hoppers. All right. This one, uh, I'm not liking my chances right now. Got a nut up. Oh, come on. Hit this son of a bitch. Stop trying to hit me and hit me. I almost just hit myself with that. Oh, man. What a disaster. Hey. I didn't realize that was a, uh... A champion. There's another one over here, too. Not this guy, but the other one. I like how when you, uh, kill things that are... When you destroy fire and things that are on fire, it changes the lighting effects in the room. Which is pretty sweet. Come on, come on, get him. Oh, dude, why did you just stop? Probably because you knew I was going to hit you. Alright. Ugh, don't like this one bit. Let's get rid of this guy on the wall, would you? It's a lot more difficult than you would think it is to use this planet of tininess. They are double butted. Double faced and double butted. It's like a double breasted suit, but disgusting. I don't know what that means. Uh, are you a wizard? Doesn't really matter. I kind of want to blow that up. All right, let's see what we got in here. That's like a boomerang. Uh,. I want it. I need to find two more cents. What else? Battery and a speckled pill that looks like like a popcorn jelly bean. Don't die in here. Don't die on the second run. Oh, there's one more cent. Just hook me up one more. One more, guys. The item room. <laughs> These guys look way cooler than they did in the last game. They look real derpy. Come on. Hit them. And a bomb. Might have some use for that. Is there any money kicking around? No. Book of Anarchy. Uh, yeah, I guess so. I might have some use for it. Hopefully I don't kill myself with it. Is there anything back here I could blow up? That would make it of use? I want that heart. Um... I don't know about all this. I don't think there's... Oh wait, I can go to the boss trap room and probably get myself killed, but there might be something awesome in there. Oh, no, that's an arcade. I'm stupid. Yeah. I'll do it. Damn it. Damn it. Alright, well, I guess I can still do that. I just want to see what that boomerang is. It's probably going to get me killed. But I want to check. Bad use of company funds. I can, I can tell it was. 
but I just, I gotta know. The boomerang, it will never leave you. Is that a one room charge or is that a time charge? It's a time charge. Hmm. So I'm trying to get a feel for how best to use it. I wonder how powerful it is. I'll wait for it to charge. Seems all right. And I'm dead. Wait, I can come back though. Oh, it's one health. One health. Oh no. I had to try a bunch of dumb things. Is this mom? No, it's Gertie. Wow, I'm real bad. I'm I'm blaming Tiny Planet for this one. I don't mind saying it. And also, I did make some really dumb choices. Why did you freeze? The boomerang freezes? Oh my god. That's... I guess it has a chance to freeze? Because I know I don't have freezing tears. It does. It has a chance to freeze. Alright, well... Ugh, that changes things. Well... Goodbye, cruel world. XOXO Lazarus. That was unfortunate. Well, thanks for watching, guys. That's episode two. Hopefully I'll do better next time. I think I'm going to take Isaac with me. Um, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up, and uh, I'll talk to you later. It's IndieGamerNews.com. Have a good one. Bye-bye.